What's up everybody? You're here with the Fly Guy, and you know what? I'm going on a rant today. I am at Grosjean Park in Worcester, Ohio, and I'm gonna go ahead and show you something. If you look here, we've got signs posted. The Clear Fork chapter of Trout Unlimited stocks the Apple Creek, which runs through this park, with uh, really big rainbow trout, brown trout, and they also put in palominos. Uh, they're just beautiful, gorgeous fish. They spend a lot of money to do this, okay? So here it says, post your fishing report, please do not use bait. You know, they, they want you to use flies and artificial lures because they don't want you to take the fish. It's catch and release, okay? As we can see right here, it's properly signed. Please practice catch and release. Well, people come in here and abuse this fishery. See this fish? This is right out by the parking lot. Somebody took this big trout and threw it right on the ground instead of releasing it back into the water so that somebody else could catch it. Look, it's right by a bench. Look, right by a bench. Somebody just threw a trout on the ground instead of putting it back in the water. If all you're gonna do is abuse a resource, you shouldn't even be here utilizing it. Practice proper catch and release and give somebody else the opportunity to catch fish later on down the line. You know, the creek was so crowded that I could barely find a place to cast. And I walked up and down uh, the stream just trying to find an open place to fish. I only ended up making a few casts. I don't mind seeing other fishermen around, but there were just too many people there on a very small body of water. And it really just kind of took the fun out of it. But I did end up meeting uh, a nice fish, a couple nice fishermen actually along the way. I met a guy named Phil. And when we were talking, he actually hooked into a nice Palomino. So I went ahead and gave him a net. You know, this fishery uh, is a stock only fishery. Uh, and, you know, it's just a place that I come to maybe once a year, maybe twice, you know, just to kind of, you know, fish for something uh, during the, you know, late fall, early winter uh, here in Ohio when not too much else is going on. If you're going to utilize a fishery like this, please try your best to use catch and release. It's so important especially with all the pressure that it's now receiving. It's so important to practice catch and release so that other people can go in and catch those fish too. I just want to take a second to thank Trout Unlimited for all the hard work that they do uh, to keep this stream clean and for all the stocking opportunities that they provide for area fishermen. If you like this video, go ahead and hit thumbs up. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more content. Thanks again for watching everybody. Take care, and we'll catch you next time.